Good morning. We're going to do a little route that we've done in the autumn. In fact, it's still the autumn. Our winter in the UK doesn't officially become winter until the 21st of December. That goes right away through to, I think it bleeds March. Or April, I can't remember. It's been a fair old while, three months. So what would that be? That'd be December, January, February. About, yeah, about March. So we'll, we'll do that when we come back next. So, autumn. And uh, November. And see if there's any change. On the Adventures of Max, we've done this before, so you could always compare the two if you wanted to. You won't, but you never know, you're like, hey, <laughs> you never know. Uh, the railway is over there to my right, and one of the lakes is over here, so formerly um, a gravel pit. So, millions of years ago, all of this was by the seaside. And you only get a gravel like that for two reasons. One, the constant pounding of the sea over the course of thousands, if not millions of years. And also glacier movement. So my money's on being a sea, being below sea level and all the gravel being on a beach. Anyway, someone's come along, they discovered that there's gravel beneath the ground and they dug up millions of tonnes. Uh, gravel is used extensively on the railway, on the tracks to keep the tracks in place, used in gardens, used in all sorts of things. Uh, yeah, as I say, it's not a bad little path in the summer, it's very overgrown, very overgrown. Uh, um, yeah, we're doing good. All the stinging nettles, if you looked at the other film, they're about six foot tall, some of them. Never seen them as tall. Oof! Out of puff already. Dear, oh dear. I say it's nice through here in the summer, but stinging nettles. Nice through in the winter, they can get muddy, slippery. Not very good. Up, up, no, no, this way. Good boy. Yeah, somebody standing on the uh, fisherman's deck over there. He wanted to go and say who he was or hello, so let's not take that chance. He's a German Shepherd, and people think German Shepherds are guard dogs. Not true. Not true at all. What are you doing? So you've always got to be in front as well. Just case great with screw jumps out on me, I suppose. Now what's he up to? Fuck, no good. What are you doing, Mr. Max? Oh dear. Oh, it's a bit slippery down there. Any the ice? A lot of frost on it. I've been here for quite a while now. I don't know if you can see the mist. Obviously the air quality is getting warmer. Uh, the water's cold, so hey presto, there's your mist. Cormorant, you can see the cormorant? Just give me the water. Well, it was a cormorant. What do you mean, we're a cormorant? Cormorant, I said, anyway. Oh, what are you like? What? No, 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 you're going to slip over it. You're going to get down there. How are you going to get down there? As you slip in there, as you slip in, you get yourself out. Happy now? There's no screws down there, is there? No cats down there, nothing. So, now what are you going to do? Oh, oh, you're clever. Oh, okay. Keep moving. Oh, smarty. Ooh. A little bit worried in case he slips over and hurts himself. If he goes in the water, you know it's going to be a soft landing. If he slips over on that wood, I'm not sure if he's going to hurt himself. And wife says, you worry too much. <laughs> he's all got to worry about it, really, isn't he? Not much else to worry about this day and age. He can't talk, he can't tell you when he's hurting. What's wrong with him? You've got to guess. And I'm not very good at guessing. Oh boy, oh boy. 
Uh, so it just fell in there, duck or something. Oh look, little baby ones. I don't know if you can see that, can you? Can they all disappear? Little, little baby grebes. Wow. They're obviously on the tree. See me or heard me coming. And uh, that was it. What's happened here? I had the film going the wrong way, didn't I? Had it on full magnification. I thought my eyes gone funny for a second. Oh, dear, 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 dear. Or a good dear. What can you say? Not a great deal. What about this one then? Do you want to expect this one, sir? Max, how about this one? Do you want to expect it? You never know, do you? I don't know, do I? Well, could be a screw riding somewhere. What do you think? Oh, a lovely photograph, wouldn't it? Shame I'm filming. Yeah, they love it, a reflection. Uh, right, off we go again. Was it all clear, by the way, was it? Yeah. No, no squirrels. As if. Oh, yeah, they might find a squirrel there when they're doing a bit of fishing. That it, but you know, all depends what goes through his little weed. The path is much, much better than it was the last time we come down here and done a bit of filming. Oh man, can we stop in here or do we? Oh, I see like this bloke, eh? Five years old, six next year, another year, I'll be veteran. Seven, my god. Whew. Yeah, him. That looks nice, that's the sun coming through. Wow, look at that. Amazing stuff. Absolutely amazing stuff. I don't know if you could hear that, there's a just train going past. That's going on the damn road. That's going away from London. Probably going out towards Cambridge, maybe. Uh -oh. Mud over there. That's how it looks nice and clear. But you go over there, you're actually walking in the mud. And it is really mud, sticky, horrible stuff. Stinks as well. Don't we, Max? We know that, don't we, Max? Yeah. From our previous adventures a few years ago. Although it's cold, I come out and it's minus... No, it's not minus, it's one Celsius, one Celsius. So it's obviously minus Fahrenheit. I don't know which part of minus Fahrenheit that would be, but it's definitely minus. But, um, one Celsius. There's no wind today. Yesterday, there was a bit of wind, and the wind's like those biting cold winds. Really horrible stuff. It doesn't matter if it's cold, you can warm up. But where's that constant wind? Ah, strange. Maxi, Maxi, Max, what are you up to, mate? He don't care where he goes as long as he goes for a walk. Go to the forest, come over here, go to the local park. There's not much here to inspect, is there? What is it with you today, anyway? Hey. Oh, is it a new thing, is it? What's, what's the idea? Deep in it. It's about two foot deep just here on the edge. Probably can't see it in a reflection. Uh, hey, gravel pit. There's a few million ton of gravel taken out of that to be this deep and this big. And uh, this is just one of the pits over here, several. And over the years they filled it with water. And uh, fish were introduced. Now, a lot of them are um, private fisheries. Big fish, are some of them, apparently. I never fished them. I haven't been fishing for donkey's years. I probably wouldn't even know how to do fishing no more. It's been such a long time. Um, I was never good at it. I think I caught seven pound pike. And uh, that's the biggest fish I've ever caught. <laughs> People go, yeah, use it for live bait, mate. Throw it and get a bigger fish. Oh, yeah, thanks. Uh, comedians, eh? I was quite pleased with it. Oh, it's missed one, look. Eh? 
I'm not going to encourage me to do that in case it slips over. You can see it's wet. And it's very, very slippery. Get wood and it's wet and you walk on it and you ain't got a proper grip on your shoes. It's like walking on ice. It's really dangerous. Uh, a lot of good places. They have the chicken wire over the wood. They allow you to have a bit of grip on your soles of your shoes or your boots. Uh, this is not always the case. Right, we've done that little bit. That's not bad going, is it? Just over 10 minutes. So, who will be watching this for 10 minutes? Come on, hands up. Looks like a big battleship over there, don't it, going across? Alright, there's another cormorant over there. Another one coming in. Now you see that cormorant? Oh. Don't forget, 21st December, official day of winter. We're still halfway through November. And, yeah, we're done. We're done. That's it. set. Good boy. What do you think of that, Len? Yeah? Can we go home there, can we? No, they did not say you could move. They did not say you could move. No.